That's more like it. I think I can actually do it now. Saving that. See if that helps. No, oh, you bastard. You bastard. I'll load that again. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> okay. This is not going well. Ah, oh, fuck you. Ah, oh, shit. Uh, pick the best place to fucking... I'm certainly getting good at <laughs> doing this combo. Uh, don't die, don't die. Once more, just a couple of more. Just a couple of more times and then he's dead. to do is smack him in the fuck no wait pause 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 ah, just save that quickly 
blood. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I want to do. Ah. <laughs> I said it before, I'll say it again, epic as fuck. The Prince of Destruction, the mighty Lord of Demons, Morgoth, was defeated for all time. The Karanians repaid their debt when the last of them sacrificed his life. My protege was now united with his ancestors, his people, in the eternal Hall of Fire of Atre, the place where the Karanian gods dwell. Gorlin, however, who had seen it all happen, returned to Uria, and he told them all about the great events which had taken place in the Fortress of Dimensions. After the great surge of demons, as those events were to be called henceforth, a monument was erected in Avoncast as a constant reminder of the Academy's rescue, and to be an admonition for all those who have become slaves to the blind greed for power. Gorlin came back to me as well, because it was he who at that time had entrusted the baby with the amulet around its neck to me, and so I learned about my protégé's incredible story. And Gorlin? Well, he was finally able to return to his beloved fairy kingdom. Okay, so uh, there you have it. That's my Avoncast Let's Play. It's an awesome game. I love it. Although at times it might not, um, you know, seem that way because I swear a lot, but that's just the way I is. Uh, that's just the way I is, baby. Uh, I really love this game. Um, I really enjoy playing it as well. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed watching it. Um, Avoncast has, has everything that I look for in a game. Great gameplay. Uh, engaging storyline um, good graphics yeah I wouldn't say it, I wouldn't say it's great graphics but it's uh, it's good enough for me um, it really has its own unique feel um, and plus it's made by a small gaming studio which is uh, which is a plus because uh, I like uh, games like that game well I tend to stay away from big gaming publishers uh, especially EA. I never buy anything from them anymore. Um, but uh, yeah, it's a really cool game. You should try to get it if you can. Um, you probably have to hunt it down somewhere. Um, if you're into RPGs, um, this is definitely a game you should play. Um, even if you're not into RPGs, um, it's it's really challenging. It really is. Uh, it. it the, the combo system that the game uses is really interesting. You ha it actually relies on skill. Um, you know, you noticed I probably went on about how the how crap the uh, equipment was, but you know you don't really need good equipment. Uh, you just need skill. You, you know, if you know how to duck, if you know how to cast your spells, if you know how to um, uh, plan out your attacks, um, use the right use the right spell for the right enemy. Um, and you'll be fine. Um, I, I I did towards the end. I did kind of mess up quite a bit, <laughs> but it, because it, it got quite a bit harder. Um, I I had didn't have the right build. Um, one thing you you probably noticed that I sort of changed the way I assign my um, 
my points and I put everything on blood magic and you know I thought that would be perfect but I forgot at the end that uh, you know Morgoth this really isn't a uh, um, is, isn't really a, a close, close combat monster although you can defeat him you just won't be as much fun um, yeah I did get there in the end uh, some bits were very frustrating uh, there's one quest that I didn't complete uh, and that was to help Kelios in his experiment just because it was so damn frustrating they could have made that a lot easier uh, and even the reward for it wasn't that great I, I did beat it once um, when I first played it and you know I was kind of like oh this is it just for all that trouble <laughs> uh, that's it I guess okay bye